dollars, you know. Yeah. It's the way know, it is, though. Both know what's at stake. Yep. All right, this is uh, Contender 6X, uh, break number five, I believe. That's what I got written on the page, at least. Uh, these are the six boxes left from the case that was opened on Tuesday. Um, so I hope these are re six really good boxes. Um, here are the teams. We had the Cardinals with Jacob. Haggards has the Falcons and the Ravens. Jerry has the Buffalo Bills. Deanne Linda has the Carolina Panthers. C.T. Ken has the Bears. Scott Stacy has the Cincinnati Bengals. A.C. Gomez has the Cleveland Browns. Jerry has the Cowboys. R.F.P. Jr. has the Denver Broncos. Haggards has the Lions. Stufan has the Packers. Paramedic has the Houston Texans. A.C. Gomez has the Indianapolis Colts. Igoff has the Jags. Jacob has the Kansas City Chiefs. Igoff has the Miami Dolphins. Jerry H. has the Minnesota um, Vikings. Uh, New England Patriot fan has the New England Patriots. Big Time Shimmy has the New Orleans Saints. New York Giants is LeBron 23. Steve has the Jets and the Raiders. RFP Jr. has the Eagles. Igoff has the Steelers. Deanne Linda has the San Diego Chargers. Uh, Scott Smith has the 49ers. Uh, Dave has Dave Shimmy has the Seahawks. Gebers has the Rams. PLM S N S J has the Buccaneers. RFP Jr. has the Titans. And Shimmy has the Washington Redskins. That should be right. Let me move the camera if something sounds wrong there. Actually, let me do one thing, guys, also. This will just take a second. I'm going to start the upload of that last break. So those guys coming in will be able to see the YouTube of the 6 o'clock break. Videos. Okay, this is a recording. Ready? That's the break right there. Upload YouTube. That I might have to dig into breakers for the video. What's going on? And I popped on the video and it gave me some server error. Let me try again on the video that's on my hard drive. No, nope, this time it popped up. It's basically all purchase based. YouTube is having me sign up for something. What the heck is going on? I don't know why that's thinking. Turn this camera and get ready for contenders. I'm dying for some good contenders boxes. Our last few breaks have been really poor on contenders. We did a full case last night. It was disappointing. Not fun to hit boxes that don't have a whole lot in it. There was a couple nice cards, but... Too many three archers. Oh, yeah, way too many of the smaller autographs on the on-cards. Keeps asking me to set up my channel for YouTube. Why would it be doing this?
Are you logged into YouTube still? Should be. It says my name. Hope it's another another account. They're trying to get me in. Try one more thing, and I'm just going to give up and do it later. Yeah, it says I have no activity. That means I'm in some sort of other account or something. I wonder why it would get there it is I think it's a second account that was trying to override it okay All good now. Sorry about that delay. Box number three. I put Friday in all these two on Tuesday just so I make sure I keep the boxes straight because I got different breaks going on here and there. We have these six boxes, and then we have one more case of contenders. And I know with all the football coming out, that might be about it for us on contenders. I'll be done about 10 cases. Uh, when's the next contenders case? I have I don't have anything planned yet. Uh, it won't be late next week because late next week there's two new products. Um, Top Series 1 Baseball, which we'll do at least twice next week. And there's a new football coming out by Tops called Tops Fire. I don't know much about it, but we'll break it at least once. So I won't have any time for contenders later in the week. I am going to do a break on Monday. I'm either going to do Bowman or Contenders on that day. I'll figure it out early tomorrow. Uh, we're going to do a division break, Bowman draft. Yeah, we're going to do a Bowman, a Bowman draft division break to, uh, tonight out of a new jumbo case. Yeah, there's museum football. Um, Scott, I think it's scheduled for maybe February. Um, Sigari is, Steve, he's a Gale Sears fan. He's not in the room, I don't think, but he, he might pop in some point tonight. I have his text too. If you have something you want to offer, send me a picture and the price. I ordered uh, museum though, Scott, I'll, I'll be doing it when it comes out. That was really nice last year. That was a lot of fun. We had some good cards in that stuff, too. We did really well. Hit an Andrew Luck 101. Yeah, it was popular last year. That was the very first break that Dave uh, did with us last year, I think, was Museum. Yeah, I thought so. Freddie did uh, Chrome before that with us, but I remember him saying that uh, he dragged you along for the museum break. Those cards were nice. Those they, are my favorite cards, the framed autographs. Really beautiful cards. 
Okay, this is box number one of contenders. Good luck, everybody, and thanks, everybody, for helping me fill this break. <laughs> That's what, you know, Shimmy, I had the same reaction when I was, I was like, what the heck is with this? And then you start thinking about them like, yeah, this might work, might be fun. Jordy Nelson parallel card to 199 for the Packers is leading it off. Got another parallel coming up. Moncrief and West insert. <laughs> you asked me about razzing. I remember that. Several people asked me first about razzing. I, uh, Jason will remember when R. Darby asked me what a razz was. He's probably, <laughs> he's been probably in 3 million razzes since then. Logan Thomas and Tom Savage. <laughs> I should be in some sort of Razzing Hall of Fame because I introduced you, Steve, and R. Darby to Razzing. And possibly even Yuval. I'm not sure if Yuval did it before he was in my room or not. But you, Yuval doesn't, I don't think, Razz quite as much as you guys that did at one point. Marquise Lee out of 199. Oh, um, you talking about Bree? She, is a, she joined the uh, military army or something like that. Yep. Johnny Manziel, Rookie of the Year. Matt, I got that Bowman um, uploading, so I'll let you know when it says uploaded on the YouTube site, and I'll drop the link if you're still in the room. Marquise Lee insert. Stafford and Johnson. Mettenberger fails. Will do. Hey, Ripken fan, are you on uh, my email list where you get um, where I send out my breaks and stuff that are not on eBay and that that sort of thing? Got an auto here. Okay, because I'll probably send that out tomorrow with what I'm going to do on Monday. Got an on card autograph. Of course, it's a Cleveland quarterback. It's going to be Connor Shaw. Connor Shaw. He'll probably. <laughs> last time I pulled him, the guy said in the chat he'll be worth more than Manziel by mid year next year, anyways. Actually played a little bit for Cleveland the last game. No problem, man. <laughs> Connor Shaw leads it off for the Cleveland Browns. The best one was Freddie getting caught by his wife watching Red Sox. <laughs> that was... He was in the closet. Uh, Ripken fan, the only thing I have left to offer tonight is that division spy.